guys and welcome back to another yes exciting movie of the Rama Builders. As you can see I got my new TiVo Tornado 3D printer today. It's fresh out of the oven. I haven't opened it yet. This is my first 3D printer. I never had one. I'm 100% noob. Uh, no sorry 99% noob. The one percent I give myself is I know what a 3D printer is. Okay guys, so let's get started again. Noob, 99%. This printer was sent by Gearbest. Um, I ordered it, I think it was the 1st of January. It's now the 5th of February. It came from China to the UK and from the UK to me. So. Let's get started guys! people complain because that was not coming off um, so I hope I won't have the same problem but for now yeah as you can see I can just do it by hand which I really like uh, yeah so far so good guys it seems like uh, this is just a 3d print that they uh, put on and left it on there also I read that the knife that came with the package isn't that good it's not sharp it's best that you take another one and use that because uh, or you can uh, sharpen this or a razor blade it's also good for now I'm not going to do this uh, I'm gonna start with the assembly of the printer Okay, so this come off fairly easily. So this is the heated bed. Okay, very nice. This can go. I also read on the internet that many of you had problems that the screws weren't tight enough. Uh, maybe during shipment they came a little bit looser. So I've read that uh, a very good idea before uh, assembling is to check the screws because once you had assembled it uh, sometimes to access the screw it will be difficult so it's better to do it now than to restart all over Now everything looks great, um, all screws were uh, tightened enough, um, just the four ones of the rubber feet, those were loose. The bottom frame, it's okay, it doesn't wobble. As you can see, I managed to pull off this print, 
Uh, to be very honest, uh, it took me less than a minute to uh, get this off. Uh, I think I got very lucky. So now we're gonna uh, attach the bed to the base. Make sure your uh, cable is to the back. And for those, you're gonna need uh, this little package. Okay, I uh, assembled the bed, now it's time to uh, mount the top frame. guys welcome back um, as you can see I uh, almost assembled the printer uh, just have to connect the power the control box uh, so far I hadn't had one screw that was loose um, so everything was uh, tightened really good uh, I had no issues at all removing the uh, stuff from the print bed was easy. It took me less than one minute. Um, yeah, so I think they really listened to the uh, commentary of the people uh, who had complaints with uh, screws that were loose. Um, but again, <clears throat> very happy with, uh, with this print so far. Uh, the assembly has gone very smooth, no issues at all. Let's uh, connect the control box.
guys, welcome back. As you can see, my printer is assembled. I think it took me around uh, 20 minutes. Again, this is my first 3D printer. I have no knowledge whatsoever. I'm a 90% noob, 1% uh, I give myself because I know what a 3D printer is and I kind of managed to get everything uh, connected so this far uh, I was very pleased with um, the uh, way of assembling everything fitted correctly uh, you cannot miss all the screws and bolt were tight uh, I hadn't had any screw that was loose. Um, the only thing that I had to adjust was the uh, print uh, printing head. This 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 little box here at the front. This was a little bit wobbling, um, but overall, again, um, the stuff on the print pad came off in, in less than a minute. I had no issues with it. Um, okay, it's time to. Uh, boot this baby up and see what it does. Hi guys, welcome back. Uh, so I assembled the printer, um, I did some test prints and I must say out of the box it prints really really good um, printed out some some files some stock files that were on the SD card and yeah without modification it prints uh, really good so the very first print that I did was this cube and as you can see I had some problems with the I access but I think um, after doing another print I think the problem was on the g-code or, or, uh, or the print itself um, or the file um, but then afterwards I did another test also a stock file that was on the SD card the simple cube and it, it, it prints perfectly uh, there is no uh, fold or, or shifting or, or nothing it, it's just perfect it's it's a square cube um, I don't have uh, any uh, elephant feet problems yeah um, that's it for now the assembly is done I will do at least 100 hours of printing and I will do another video on uh, this printer some kind of review where I will explain my thoughts and my findings if I run into problems how I fix that um, I will also do uh, some uh, prints of modifications to uh, maybe improve the print quality or yeah I don't know again this is my first 2d printer I don't have a lot of experience but I just wanted to show you that even a noob like me can sample this um, 2d printer Again, it's the Tivo Tornado. So, I will be seeing you all very soon in uh, my next video about this uh, 3D printer. Two Rama Builders signing out. Bye, guys.